Part of what the, the CGI research program on livestock and fish has been doing is around capacity development. So it's capacity development of the non-gender scientists on how to integrate gender into their, their work. Another piece has been around building up the institutional architecture to support gender integration. So that means incentivizing interdisciplinary teams where gender and non-gender scientists are working together. Part of that is uh, having a gender initiative representative on the uh, program management committee. Um, and, and we've seen that, uh, seen that happening. There's also a gender tax being put in place, so that's a, um, a percentage of the overall budget for each of the uh, flagships, which will go towards uh, gender activities, gender research and various other mechanisms. So that's been quite interesting to see how it's, it's been developing over the course of, um, of KIT's engagement with livestock and fish. And we've really seen, uh, as we start shifting towards phase two for the CRP fish and separately the CRP livestock, uh, a lot of that learning from the CRP livestock and fish around gender integration and what's needed for that to effectively happen is being brought into the phase two planning and the phase two proposals. Uh, so for example, uh, ways of systematizing the gender budgeting which is done across the, uh, the CRP uh, and ensuring that um, gender scientists are um, supported in terms of their time that they're, they're putting into the gender integration work, into the non-strategic non gender research, uh, that they're also represented uh, in the authorship and in the um, in, well, in the full process of the gender uh, analysis and inter interpretation and so on. So it's been a, an exciting journey and I think the next, step into, the next steps into phase two um, are really building on this foundation, not just of the, of the results of the findings from the COACH projects and from phase one, but, uh, but also in terms of how to do research differently in order to uh, effect change. And I think we've got some robust agendas moving into phase two, uh, both for the CRP fish as well as for the CRP livestock.